Hello, welcome to GCSE Biology Required Practical Activity 1. So this is related to microscopy. So what I'm going to do today is show you how to uh, produce a slide and how to use the microscope. So just a few things about the microscope first, okay? So the microscope um, has different um, parts to it. So you have the eyepiece, you then have the objective lens, lenses, the stage, this is where you put the um, microscope slide, and then you've got what we call a coarse adjustment and a fine adjustment, and then down below we've got the light that is shining up through the specimen. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to prepare an onion slide. So first of all you need a piece of onion, okay, and I'm just going to um, peel it very, very carefully. Actually, I'm going to just cut it to make it quite thin. So I'm going to make a thin sample. And then I'm going to place it on a glass slide. Okay. So you just place it flat on the glass slide, like so. Now, because it's quite transparent, what I've got to do is put um, some, some uh, colour stain on it. So what I'm going to use is iodine. So all you do is you place a couple of drops of iodine on top of the onion like so and then we need to use a cover slip so cover slips are very very thin you can hardly see them but very thin so you need to be very careful when you're using them that they don't smash because they can smash quite easily and then you take the tweezers and rather than just plonking it on top if you just plonk it on top you get lots of air bubbles so what you've got to do very very carefully is lower using the tweezers lower down your cover slip like so there we go should do something like that okay right so now i'm going to place it onto the microscope stage um, before i do that i'm just going to lower the microscope stage down and then place it onto the microscope like so going to adjust it and what you've got to do before you focus the microscope is make sure that the stage is quite high up to the lens so that's as high as it will go okay and then you're going to focus downwards so just put your eye to the eye lens and you focus downwards until you get an image and then you can use the fine adjustment here to get a clearer image. So once you've done that, you can then maybe draw what you have found um, and also maybe work out the, the size of each cell, which I will show you later. So that's the onion cell. Now there is another type of cell we can look at which is an animal cell, and um, we're going to use cheek cells. So what I've done earlier is I've gathered some cheek cells from using a cotton bud. So I've literally put it in my mouth, inside of my mouth and swabbed the inside of my mouth. I'm then going to use a slide and I'm going to just place the cells. You can't see the cells, place them on there. Okay, and then I'm gonna just put that away over there. And then I'm going to use um, this colour indicator called methylene blue. So methylene uh, blue, you only need one drop. So if I put one drop, there you go. Now you have to be careful with methylene blue because it stains. So you've got to be careful it doesn't get on your fingers. If it does get on your fingers, then you need to wash it straight away. So again, the same as before. 